Hello everyone, my name is Andrea C. I heart cross stitch. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review of bead embroidery or beaded cross stitch. Uh, several weeks ago I was contacted by a fellow stitcher from uh, Ukraine and her name is either Natalie or Natali. I'm not really sure how you pronounce it in uh, Ukrainian, but she contacted me and asked me if um, I was interested in trying bead embroidery and or beaded cross stitch and um and i said yes and she said that she had a shop on etsy and if i could um, look through there and let her know what i was interested in and she would send me um a few items and and ask me if i would do a review so that's what i'm doing right now um so one of um here's the I don't want to show you my address. Nope, doesn't show anything. All right, so this is the envelope that the kit came in. Here is the name of her shop. It's all it's all about embroidery UA, and it came with an instruction chart. And again, here is her information all about embroidery UA. You can find this on Etsy. I will include a link below. But as you can see, it's all in English. And there is a QR code, which I believe takes you to, um, if you scan it, it takes you to a video on YouTube that she has posted as to how to go about doing the bead embroidery. She was so very kind to send me a, a scroll frame and which I was really excited about because I don't have a scroll frame until now. And I've always wanted to try one, but I wasn't really sure whether I would like it or not. And I really like it. So I'm very uh, grateful for that. And the, um, the scroll frame came with instructions in several different languages, I believe, as to go about how to put it together. And so here is one of the bead embroidery or beaded cross stitch kits that she sent to me. As you can see, I've started it. So now that I've shown this to you, you can see the scroll frame. And I'm going to show you, so what came in the package was the instructions and this. Okay, so I'm going to take it off the scroll frame so that you can see it close up. So just give me one second. Okay. So with the with the scroll frame, basically there's this slat here. And you lay the uh, the fabric against the slat and then you just clip it in place. And it comes with four clips on each side and it also came with all of the beads that you need so I will show that to you in in depth in just a second so here I will show you this part right here so as you can see the beads lay at a diagonal Hopefully it will focus. Focus. So you can see here, I'm sorry. I feel like I'm not doing justice to explaining how to do this, but you, you come it, and it comes with, um, the a beading needle, which is very sharp, and this Madeira um, beading thread, and it came with this beading needle, and all of these beads. Now, the beads came in little, small plastic bags, but I transferred them to the bead containers that I already have and use. They all have these stickers on them, so 
Let me get all the beads out. And I, I will show you, I do have another kit and I, that I will show you how it comes uh, without taking the beads. So they came in little baggies with these stickers on them. So I just poured the beads into the little containers and um, took the sticker off of the baggie and put it on here. So we have a light pink beads and medium pink and a beautiful red. Oh, here, and a deeper, even deeper red. Fun little orangey yellow. And the greens. The lightest green. Dark, a little bit of a darker green. A little bit darker. And darkest. So those are the beads that came with it, and I'm really excited about this. I think it's gorgeous. It's called Spring Tulips. And here is uh, the key that it comes with. So you can see that if it's a light pink, it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's very clear. I mean, it's very easy to see which one is the darker red. As you can see here, there are four tones of, of, of pink, like light pink, the next lightest, or the next darker, the next darkest, and then the darkest. And the same goes with the the leaves. You have the the four different shades of green. One, two, three, four. So it's very simple to to see which which shade that you need to choose for the bead. Okay, love it. Let me show you the um, the kit that. I have that I have not started if you just give me one second so I can put these bead packs away it's very kind of her to send this to me okay so let me show this to you I believe it's in this envelope nope it's in this one okay so it comes in a, in a package like this. And so you would just take it out of the plastic and attach it to a scroll frame. It's highly recommended apparently that you um, stitch this using a scroll frame, not a hoop. Uh, or Q-snaps. I don't think Q-snaps would work because unless you, would, unless you had a Q-snap that was bigger than this no I still don't think it would work because the the Q snaps would overlap on the beaded area because there's not that big of a margin between the end of the project and the end of the fabric so I, I really don't think Q snaps would work very well but as you can see this is just regular and it, and it comes with this um, interfacing on the back so it adds a nice stability to the fabric and if you hear that beeping, my coffee maker is telling me that it turned itself off. So, there's the fabric. There's the key. I think it's very easy to determine uh, which, which beads go with what color. There isn't... Uh, there aren't any colors there that are so similar that it would be difficult to differentiate between them and the, the it comes with the x x the uh, instructions on how to go about doing it and the beads come like this it comes in a, a big bag and then all the little bags we have uh, oh beautiful from see it comes like this all of these beads Come in little baggies. Oops, I'm dropping. They come in little baggies, and you get the the um, the thread that you need to bead with, and a needle that comes uh, on a card. It's very sharp, like I mentioned earlier. 
So all, it all comes together and uh, it's, they're very reasonable prices. I highly recommend that you go check her out on Etsy. Again, I will put a link to her shop below and um, the frame that she has, the scroll frames, um, very reason reasonably priced as well. I probably will be ordering uh, more of them in bigger sizes so I can put some of my Mirabilia's on them, possibly a few future Chatelaine. So again, this one I will be working on when this one is done. Uh, it's very simple. You just come up, you come, you come up, bottom left and you insert the bead onto the needle and go down top right and the needle sits at an angle and it perf perfectly covers the um, the colored area so I am looking forward to sharing th this with you when it is complete and again I want to thank Natalie or Natalie for sending uh, these kits to me and introducing me to the world of beaded embroidery or beaded cross stitch. Again, all of her information will be below. And I thank you for watching this video. And I hope you have a wonderful day. Goodbye.